Well, in the case of Trump, for instance, we know he is openly racist, but it allows whites and the, um, and the police to feel comfortable enough to even hurt, kill people. Sleepy waves, the police have been racist for decades. They've been doing this in the background for decades, right? I personally prefer it being in the light, right? Like, for example, I'll mention one thing about Trump, right? A lot of people hate on Trump. He's, he's, a, he's a whatever, right? We already talked about what Trump is, right? But one thing you have to appreciate about Trump, right? For decades, American presidents have been waging war, sending their U.S. troops, NATO troops, into other countries on the guise of bringing democracy to those countries. Trump has come out and openly admitted that US military is being used to plunder resources of other nations. I rather have that than someone like Obama saying that they're there to spread democracy instead of telling Americans the truth that they're there to plunder the resources of other nations and kill hundreds of thousands of people. Trump is saying it the way it is. I want things to be in the light, not in the background. Because when things are in the background, behind closed doors, well-intentioned people, and the road to hell is paved with good intentions, well-intentioned people support psychopaths when things are in the light psychopaths are obvious right to everyone who they are that way well-intentioned people can't support them in good conscience okay imagine believing that uh, soldiers are fighting for your freedom in another country that's not a threat to your own country sticks are mana you know how many people i've talked to in canada and the united states that actually believe that right smedley butler wrote a book on war is a racket telling people and he wrote that book in the 1930s right the most decorated marine in u.s history for Ever until like 10 years ago right I think they they decorated other people just so we, we, we couldn't call uh, General Smedley Butler the most decorated Marine in US history right but he wrote a book telling everyone in the world that the American military US military and Western militaries all militaries really uh, I don't want to say all militaries but most militaries right Western militaries for sure Canada United States Germany France Italy all of them UK right they are the blunt force, the brute force that Western governments use to plunder the resources of other nations for corporations, right? He wrote this book in the 1930s or something. Trump right now is admitting that. Smedley Butler, when he wrote that book, no US president, as far as I know, has ever admitted that fact. Trump has admitted that fact. He deserves respect for that, right? He is telling people why they have a military, right? Soldier, you are about to go into this nation, kill thousands of people and plunder their resources. That's what recruitment should be. Are you willing to do it?